Welcome back friends, this is Solomon Jagwe. I'm back with another quick insight and today is an exciting day guys, especially when it comes to facial motion capture for users of iClone guys and also for Character Creator 3. So today uh, it just came out, uh, iClone 7.9 was released and with it came a bunch of updates, you know. So there's a major, a major update of uh, the 3D facial animation. You can see the facial expressions, the lip sync animation. There's so much that they've added in here. You know, just that, guys. There's also uh, things like uh, smart hair in uh, Character Creator 3, the hair and beard. So I'll be doing a separate video for that. And this is going to change a lot of the way we do work in iClone and Character Creator 3. And I think the challenge is definitely that uh, we're going to be able to get, I think, closer to doing the uh, meta-human kind of appearance. You know, you see that over there. And there's also the smart beard. This is really, really, really cool. So I'm excited to dig in with a... <laughs> You know, so every now and then, you know, an update comes out and I, I feel like super excited. But this one I had to share with you guys. So the most important update, I think, in uh, iClone is the introduction of uh, the air kit blend shapes with the characters that are coming into iClone. And all of those characters are coming from Character Creator 3, which has been updated with the new morphs for the default character that comes in. So when you create a character in CC3, Character Creator 3, you'll be able to bring that character into iClone and then do a much improved uh, version of the facial animation. So they've updated the lip sync, they've updated the blend shapes for the character. So this is going to be awesome. And ultimately, you'll be able to send this to the Unreal Engine, guys. So Here's a quick test. First, I highly, highly recommend, guys, that you go to the App Store and update to 1.08 right there. And because you need the new update of the, the app, the iOS app, Live Face uh, app for, from Reillusion, not the Live Link Face. This is uh, not the Live Link Face from Epic Games. This is the Live Face app from Reallusion, you need this in order for you to be able to take advantage of the new AR kit blend shapes that have been added into uh, into iClone and also into Character Creator 3. So let's take it for a quick ride, guys. So in here, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna make sure I'm logged in first of all uh, that my app is running. Make sure you install it and it's running and it's uh, 1.08. And then I'm going to go to here, just a second. All right, I'm going to go select the character, make sure I select the face here, go to plugins up at the top, go to motion live, motion live over here click on that and then bring it up and make sure you put in the correct ip address so your ip address that is on the phone <laughs> i'm trying to cover mine right there so that's the ip address that you need to use okay and let me go back over here and you put it in the live face uh, uh, ip address right there so turn on live face Okay, as long as it's uh, the correct IP address, it should be able to uh, turn green right there. And then on the character, make sure the character is selected. Uh, this character is called Debra. And then over on the face, switch to live face right there, like that. Okay, and then you're going to see the magic. So press uh, space bar to preview. Hold on a second. Let me do that again make sure the character is selected live face is on let's uh, rewind all right make sure the character is selected preview spacebar 
okay so I'm gonna move the camera over here sorry about that so you can see and actually this is I'm, I'm using Wi-Fi right now but if you have like a keyboard connection you'll be able to actually get better performance let me move it over there and what's impressive guys I think this is closer to a more one-to-one uh, -one ratio even better than I think the live link face up so you can already see the improvements you know this is much better and the way you see the difference right is go to the mapping over here and you notice that up on the profile there's that there are two profiles now there's the default profile and I'm gonna switch to the default profile so you see the difference okay and close this window and let me move the camera over here so I can see myself and so that's the default pro uh, profile see like when I'm doing that it's pretty good still right but then if you switch to let's switch to the air kit version now you get more nuance in the animation on the facial animation that is the big big improvement in uh, the character creator 3 model that is now inside can be used inside of iClone and you're able to animate your 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 character the character that you've created and which means that if you are going to be creating uh, custom characters for your for to, to be used uh, to take advantage of this new update make sure that your character has the 52 blend shapes that are supported by the AR kit okay and uh, I think this is this is big guys <laughs> this is a, a thing that has been you know in iClone for a while but the fact that now we have it in here is awesome so thank you so much for joining me guys I'll continue to share more of this as I work with this and once I have this installed as well I'll do another update but as always dare to dream big guys never give up on your dreams and thank you so much for your support don't forget to hit subscribe and also to hit that notification bell thank you as always guys and bye for now this is a beautiful beautiful update thank you so much real illusion bye bye for now guys see you next time